Okay, so this looks complicated, but it's really quite simple. Uh, for example, beta-carotene has lots of single-double, single-double bonds, so-called conjugated double bonds, and that will absorb visible radiation. The chemical below, with the unpronounceable name, is actually another food colouring, and that also has lots and lots of single and double bonds conjugated together, so that will absorb visible. So if there's many, many of these conjugated bonds, it absorbs visible and therefore it will have a colour itself, the complementary colour of whatever's absorbed. So if there's less than three sets of these conjugated double bonds, they will actually absorb ultraviolet only, and so it will have no colour. The actual chemical itself will have no colour. If you absorb ultraviolet, well that doesn't matter, I can't see ultraviolet. But if it has four or more conjugated double bonds, then it's going to absorb some colour. For example, it might absorb orange, and therefore it would look blue, the complementary colour. So they're coloured.